We live in a world of abundant food choices. Every aisle in the grocery store is packed with a myriad of options, from fresh produce to packaged goods. The sheer variety can be overwhelming. Grocery stores and restaurants offer a dizzying array of options. Buffets present an endless selection of dishes, and store shelves are lined with countless products, each vying for our attention. Many of these foods are highly processed and calorie dense. Packaged snacks, sugary cereals, and ready-to-eat meals are convenient but often come with a high calorie count and low nutritional value. This makes healthy eating a challenge. Reading food labels can be confusing, and understanding nutritional information requires effort and knowledge. Shoppers often feel overwhelmed by the choices and the need to make the right decisions. It's easy to succumb to temptation. The allure of a candy bar or a bag of chips can be hard to resist, especially when they are conveniently placed at eye level or near the checkout counter. We often reach for sugary drinks, fast food, and processed snacks. These items are not only convenient, but also heavily marketed, making them a frequent choice for many. These choices can have negative consequences for our health. Consuming high amounts of sugar, salt, and unhealthy fats can lead to discomfort and long-term health issues. Obesity, type 2 diabetes, and other metabolic disorders are becoming increasingly common. Struggling with daily activities and managing blood sugar levels are just some of the challenges faced by those affected. Heart disease is also on the rise. Poor dietary choices contribute significantly to the development of cardiovascular issues, which can have serious, life-threatening consequences. These conditions are linked to poor dietary choices. However, with the right guidance and determination, it is possible to make better choices. Consulting a nutritionist and creating a balanced diet plan can be the first steps towards a healthier lifestyle. Making healthier eating choices is crucial for our well-being. Incorporating more fresh fruits and vegetables into our meals, cooking at home, and being mindful of portion sizes can make a significant difference. By prioritizing nutrition, we can improve our health and quality of life. Our brains play a significant role in our eating habits. They are the control center for our cravings, preferences, and even the amount of food we consume. When we understand how our brain influences these aspects, we can make more informed choices about what we eat. They influence our food cravings, preferences, and portion control. For instance, when we see a delicious piece of cake or a bag of chips, our brain sends signals that make us want to eat them, even if we know they aren't the healthiest options. Understanding this connection is key to making lasting changes. By learning how our brain works in relation to food, we can start to make better choices that align with our health goals. This knowledge empowers us to take control of our eating habits. The brain's reward system is activated when we consume certain foods. This system is designed to make us feel good when we eat, which is why we often reach for comfort foods when we're stressed or unhappy. Foods high in sugar, fat, and salt trigger the release of dopamine. This neurotransmitter is responsible for feelings of pleasure and reward, making us feel happy and satisfied when we eat these foods. Dopamine is a neurotransmitter associated with pleasure and reward. When we eat something delicious, our brain releases dopamine, reinforcing the behavior and making us want to repeat it. This creates a cycle of craving and consumption. The more we indulge in these foods, the more our brain craves them, leading to a continuous loop of unhealthy eating habits. The more we indulge in these foods, the more our brains crave them. This can lead to overeating and weight gain as our brain's reward system becomes more and more dependent on these unhealthy foods for pleasure. Breaking this cycle requires rewiring our brain's reward system. This can be done by gradually introducing healthier foods into our diet and finding new ways to reward ourselves that don't involve food. For example, we can reward ourselves with a relaxing activity or a new hobby instead of a sugary treat. By making small, consistent changes to our eating habits, we can train our brain to crave healthier foods. This process takes time and patience, but the benefits are well worth the effort. Over time, our brain will start to associate healthy foods with pleasure and reward, making it easier to maintain a balanced diet. This shift in mindset can lead to lasting changes in our eating habits and overall health. In addition to changing our diet, incorporating regular physical activity can also help rewire our brain's reward system. Exercise releases endorphins, which are natural mood boosters, 
and can help reduce cravings for unhealthy foods. Keeping a journal of our eating habits and health goals can also be a helpful tool in this process. By tracking our progress and reflecting on our choices, we can stay motivated and focused on our goals. Finally, surrounding ourselves with a supportive community can make a big difference. Sharing our journey with friends and family can provide encouragement and accountability, making it easier to stay on track. Understanding the connection between our brain and our eating habits is the first step towards making lasting changes. With knowledge, patience, and support, we can break the cycle of unhealthy eating and create a healthier, happier life. Research has shown that dopamine plays a central role in food cravings. Dopamine is a neurotransmitter, a chemical messenger in the brain, that is crucial for many functions, including motivation, reward, and pleasure. When we engage in activities that are essential for survival, such as eating, dopamine is released, creating a sense of enjoyment and satisfaction. This release of dopamine reinforces the behavior, making us more likely to repeat it in the future. When we consume sugary or fatty foods, dopamine is released in the brain's reward center, this area of the brain, known as the nucleus accumbens, is activated and we experience a rush of pleasure. This pleasurable sensation is what makes us crave these types of foods. The brain essentially rewards us for consuming high-calorie foods, which were crucial for survival in our evolutionary past. This creates a feeling of pleasure, reinforcing the behavior. The more we indulge in these foods, the more our brain associates them with positive feelings. This is why we often reach for comfort foods when we are stressed or feeling down. The brain's reward system is powerful and can override our rational decision-making, leading us to choose immediate pleasure over long-term health benefits. Studies have also found that repeated exposure to these foods can lead to changes in the brain. Over time, the brain's reward system becomes less sensitive to dopamine. This means that the same amount of food no longer produces the same level of pleasure. As a result, we need to consume more of the food to achieve the same feeling of satisfaction. This phenomenon is known as tolerance and is similar to what happens with addictive substances like drugs and alcohol. The brain becomes less sensitive to dopamine, requiring more of the food to achieve the same level of pleasure. This can lead to overeating and weight gain as we continually seek out more food to satisfy our cravings. The cycle of craving, consumption, and reduced sensitivity can be difficult to break, leading to unhealthy eating habits and potential health issues such as obesity, diabetes, and heart disease. This explains why it can be so difficult to break unhealthy eating habits. Our brains have been conditioned to seek out high-calorie foods, and the reduced sensitivity to dopamine makes it challenging to find satisfaction in healthier options. The conflict between wanting to eat healthily and craving unhealthy foods can be a constant struggle for many people. Our brains become wired to crave these foods, making it challenging to resist. However, understanding the role of dopamine and the brain's reward system can help us develop strategies to overcome these cravings. By gradually reducing our intake of sugary and fatty foods and finding healthier ways to reward ourselves, we can retrain our brains to find pleasure in more nutritious options. This process takes time and effort but it is possible to break the cycle and develop healthier eating habits. While it may seem daunting, it is entirely possible to rewire your brain for healthier eating habits. Start by gradually reducing your intake of processed foods, sugary drinks, and unhealthy fats from your diet. Focus on incorporating more whole, unprocessed foods into your daily meals. Fruits, vegetables, Lean proteins and whole grains provide essential nutrients without the added sugars and unhealthy fats. Another helpful tip is to practice mindful eating every day. Pay close attention to your food, savoring each bite and listening to your body's hunger and fullness cues. If you found these tips helpful, please support our channel by subscribing. Thank you.